Good morning, Davis Inspiration Studios family. It's Tuganay. Yay. I am up at about 3 o'clock in the morning. This is the only time that I get to have some level of quiet in the house. Um, so I apologize that I'm coming to you um, where you're seeing this Saturday morning just before classes. Um, we are going to get to our own facility. The goal is by the end of the year, but we are going to experience some ups and downs in route. And today is one of those days. So I want to be sure I give you a little bit of background about today. Um, I typically try to work through the end of the day, um, on a weekday to prepare for, our Saturday and sometimes I go all the way up until Friday so that was my situation yesterday um, so I would love to come to you much earlier than now however um, if I'm really putting in the work and putting in the effort I'm working up until the very last opportunity to be sure I get the facility that we need or whatever it potentially is that we need for a Saturday so um, today I ended up speaking with two of our parents before I totally made a decision to cancel class for today. And it was not an easy decision to say the least because, um, you guys are extremely supportive. One, um, two, I know that you guys believe in what we're doing. And if there's not some consistency, what is there to believe in? That's how I feel. Although you guys are, a lot of you are just like, whatever, this is what we're doing. This is how we're going to get there. And I just don't want to take advantage of that because it's very, very generous on your part. So my goal is to always be transparent. I work very diligently and apologize a lot of times that, oh, okay, so we're breaking up Saturday morning. Are we doing this? Or are we not doing this? That is not easy for every family. Some families are like, Okay, no big deal. Some families, that's not the scenario. So I want to be sensitive of that, um, sensitive to that, and be sure that you know that I'm thinking about that. Some of you guys drive from far distances, so that means that you have to plan your day ahead so that you can actually make dance class. So I'm sensitive to that too. So there's a few things and different dynamics with different families that I want to be sure that you know I'm working until the umpteenth hour to be sure that the consistency that we have is not altered. But like today, this is one of those days. So you guys are a supportive community and I'm frequently reminded that is not that the community that we're building is not about dance and the arts. It's about the impact of the community that we're having. Our girls and our dancers, um, our artists are building friendships that are going to last a lifetime. They are learning good eating behavior for artists and especially for dancers. That's very important at a very young age. Um, they're learning not just the technique, but they're learning how to embrace their own style. They're learning more than most dance studios will offer. And we incorporate life planning on top of the technique and the dancing. I have to be reminded of that. A lot of times my parents remind me of that. So I understand that we're not just here to dance every Saturday. However, I do want to be transparent and want to bring you as close as possible to understanding what's happening on this end. So that's why I do these videos. I didn't do any of them last year. We had one class. There was nothing to really juggle we didn't run into these challenges or these obstacles when it was just one class for today what happened what happened was um jackie robinson center is working with us in, in an incredible fashion to be sure that they can support us in any way possible but they have their red tape that we have to follow through and if for some reason i can't meet that then Jackie Robinson is not going to be able to support us. That happened this week. My insurance certificate, the whole month, um, the whole month of March's 
um, costs for each day as well as the um, deposit needed to be in by Thursday, which was an extension that I received. However, it needed to be in by, th technically by three o'clock, and I had a window until five. However, between three and five, I could have a certain, I could have a deposit down by three, but I, if I missed the three o'clock deadline, then I needed to have the insurance certificate and the full month and the deposit. My insurance certificate was not going to make it by five o'clock. So um, there went our Saturday. <laughs> so on Thursday, I discovered that. And um, by the time I started moving and grooving, I said, okay, well, you know, we're going to make some adjustments. We're going to go to the park. I had already thought to myself, okay, well, if for some reason my insurance certificate can't get to me in time for this deadline, then no biggie. We're going to go to the park because my main thing right now is getting ready for August 19th. August 19th, as you remember, is Rhythms of the Village and we need to rehearse. I need to bring all the classes together for some of the things that we've been rehearsing and be sure that we're all on the same page, immersion right. So I said, okay, no, no worries, we can go to the park. Earlier in the week, I checked that out, the, the temperature outside, gonna be 60 degrees. Mm, no, I'm not putting the kids out in 60 degree weather, not gonna happen. So what I said was, okay, let me call Elements. Let me call Elements, let me call Elements. I'll call Elements. So I called Elements and they said, oh, okay, yeah, we've got you for the rest of March. No biggie. Um, and yeah, we'll see you. I said, okay, see you tomorrow. They were like, whoa, 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 whoa. wait, tomorrow? Like tomorrow, like March 7th? Oh, no, 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 no. We have a big event going on on March 7th. That's not going to happen, but we got you booked for the 14th. <laughs> okay, see you on the 14th. See you on the 14th. All right. So here we are. <laughs> here we are. Um, I even had one person stick their neck out for us to make a phone call late last night to see if another facility was available. And she's yet to get a return call. Um, so we're doing this together. Yay. <laughs> so. That is the background on why there are no classes today. However, tune in to Facebook on our Facebook page, Davis Inspiration Studios, and we're going to read the books that we um, had intended for class today. Facebook Live on our Facebook page at 1230 today. If for some reason you miss it, what we're going to do is put it here on this YouTube page. So be sure to subscribe. Be sure to um, turn on the alerts so that when we do drop a video, you already know. Let me also give you the background for the duration of the year until we get our brick and mortar. Jackie Robinson Park is going to become our second location. So we have a long-term and a long-standing relationship with Element Stand Space. We are adding to that. Jackie Robinson. So all of our Saturday classes that we currently have going, as long as it doesn't co conflict with their schedule, is going to be at Jackie Robinson Park. Yay! I love it. So moving forward into the month of April, um, that is the expectation. Yay! I still have a few more um, obligations to meet because my insurance certificate still is not the way that it's supposed to be. So I've got to get that in order for us to be there in April. So I expect that it will meet their deadline now since it's for, for April, but it does have to be 15 days before our first uh, class there in April. Um, next Saturday, March 14th, we are going to be at Elements Dance Space, all classes from Doodly and Me to Doodly D. So from our one-year-old and two-year-olds to our five to six-year-olds, we are going to be at Elements Dance Space from 1 to 3.30. We are going to be merging 
all the classes for that one uh, performance that we have on April 19th. On April 19th, please mark your calendar for 3.30 p.m. to be at Rhythms of the Village. I have the address in the description down below. On the 21st, we will be at the Dorothy Chandler Pavilion for Alvin Ailey. And on the 28th, we'll be back at Elements Dance Space for our open house. So, very, very exciting. Um, we'll be celebrating birthdays. We'll be dancing. It's a lot of fun. Please tell your family and your friends to come. It's going to be fun times for all.